everybody. My name is Anthony Demingon. I am NAFQ's Senior Vice President and Chief Operating Officer, and I'm here today to talk to you about NAFQ's annual conference and exhibition, our 45th, which will be in Nashville, Tennessee in 2012. Conferences, I think, are a two-way uh, two street. We're going to do everything we can to put on the best show possible, but to get the most out of the conference, there are certain things I think you need to do as an attendee. So that's what we're going to talk about today. I've got seven tips that I think will help you get the most out of Nashville. Number one, do your homework. The more that you know about your credit union, the better the conference is going to be. Know your strengths, your weaknesses, your key partners. I'm telling you, the more you know, the better the conference. Number two, make a battle plan. We're going to have a lot of information on the conference speakers, the sessions, the general tracks. It can be overwhelming, but just take five minutes and a cup of coffee, take a look at our conference guide, our or other materials and, and see what makes sense based on point one. You did your homework, now what makes the most sense based on that homework. Number three, sessions are great, we have a lot of experts, but don't forget to hit the hall. We have an amazing assembly of NAFQ preferred partners and other exhibitors. These are businesses that have made a living out of solving problems for financial firms. So hit the hall, do a general walkthrough to get the lay of the land, but then make notes. Ah, I need to talk to that person. They're in mortgages, and boy, we're having some issues with mortgages this year. That might be just one example. So hit the hall and get that knowledge out. Take those contacts back and distribute them to the proper person at your credit union. Number four, network. Now obviously we're going to have great cocktail receptions and Friday night events. We're going to have forums and we're going to have other areas that are focused on what you do at your credit union. But here's the thing, every opportunity is a networking opportunity. It could be a lunch, it could be walking downtown in Nashville and seeing somebody with a credit union logo on their shirt. Networking sometimes scares people, you don't want rejection, you don't want to bother somebody. Well here's, a, I'm telling you, people love to brag. They love to brag about their kids, their football team, they love to brag about their credit union. So here's a simple trick, walk up to somebody and say, hey, you know, I'm Anthony, I'm from ABC Credit Union. I'm curious, is there anything cool or in, you know, kind of ingenious that your credit union implemented this year? I'd love to learn all about it. You'll come home with a treasure chest full of great ideas. Number five, sometimes at a conference there's so much information going around, it can be easy to be passive. The lights kind of dim down in the room, you kind of sit there. Try to listen with the focus. As you're sitting there, ask yourself, how can I implement what this speaker's talking about at my credit union? How can I use it to improve my life? Or who at my credit union needs this information, this PowerPoint presentation? You know, listen with the focus, get the information back to the right person. Number six, build a trip report. In our fast-paced world, you get off the plane, you get down, you get busy, you're answering emails, and all that conference experience and knowledge starts to erode minute by minute. A trip report forces you to sit down and analyze the experience. It, it basically crystallizes the thought and it's invaluable for a number of reasons. Got to do a trip report and share it with your colleagues. Finally, you know, you've got to explore Nashville. Every time there's a conference, it's a new town. There's great experiences, neighborhoods, museums, food, uh, bars and restaurants. We're going to be at the uh, Grand Ole Opry on Friday night. You got to explore. So, you know, use those websites to tell you the great things to do in Nashville and soak up all Nashville has to offer. Hey, for more information, you can visit nafu.org backslash annual. Again, my name is Anthony Dumbgon and I really look forward to seeing you at Nashville. Thanks for your time. You